basically this work um, is more or less inspired by um, my travels abroad to Europe and Morocco uh, specifically. And um, in talking to people, sort of the, the reactions that a lot of people have um, towards America as a result of our recent uh, foreign policy. And, um, and it inspired me to, to do what I can to, to send the message that I believe in, um, that as an American I don't agree with what's going on. And, um, and I also think that many Americans don't. It, it's, and I think it, it creates a lot of false uh, impressions. Um, I did some research and, and collected images that um, were entirely too uh, graphic to be shown uh, on mainstream media outlets and um, presented them in a way in which I thought was both um, palatable for the viewer, viewer to see and uh, at the same time carrying out the message that I, I wanted it to, that, that um, this is what's going on and, and uh, just force the viewer to sort of think about it a little more. It's a series of, of um, 16 images of, um, dead, well, 12 of which are, are pictures of dead civilians, 4 of which are pictures of just photojournalist shots of um, civilians in Iraq. And um, for the most part, they're mutilated corpses, um, really horrific images that um, I was, I altered in Photoshop and then um, painted using the palette for, for just four values. And, uh, and so they're, uh, they're also intended to be sort of, um, I was inspired by the iPod commercial, so that's where the iPod comes from, so that graphic uh, sort of uh, hip, hip type of uh, quality that sort of is supposed to be initially it's supposed to draw you in, and then when you realize more of what you're looking at, it's supposed to make you think a little bit deeper about it. And, uh, so.